guys, welcome back to another Let's Play with me, Illus Jason, and today we're going to play Stronghold, uh, Stronghold HD, uh, I used to play this a while ago, uh, when it first came out a few years ago, um, it is uh, an RTS um, castle building simulation Game. Um, uh, this, so this version. What we got? We got combat-based games, economic-based games, some map editor, uh, loading save games, options, tutorials. We'll bother with tutorial. No one needs to read the book. Um, anyway, uh, for this little series, I think I will go through. A combat based campaign um, this is just basically building up uh, a castle defending and attacking other castles and stuff like that uh, economic based game is more about building up resources and you know stockpiling and making sure all your citizens are happy in your castle uh, map, map editor is Map editor um, and load the save game. That's what it says. So we'll, we'll go with a combat based game. Uh, we've got a play military campaign, play a siege, play an invasion, and play a multiplayer game. Uh, go through the sort of play a siege. Um, I think that's when you're defending the castle and so. Um, the computer's trying to attack you. Uh, playing invasion is the other way around, where you're the attacker, um, and the, the computer AI is defending. Might play as my player. So we're playing a military campaign. Um, I have been playing a little bit, but we'll start with uh, the first mission: gathering the gathering the lost. Um, so we we'll start the mission. Act 1, the Fallen Kingdom. As soon as the king had marched his army into the barbarian homeland, rumours began of a plot to seize the throne. When news came of the king's capture, the country was invaded. Several nobles, including your father, sought to end the bloodshed, but on the way to meet for negotiations, their party was massacred by a band of unknown raiders. Bruised and exhausted, you have been beaten back to a forest on an overlooked peninsula where a small group of loyal troops are hiding. Although the country is lost, maybe from this refuge you can at least avenge your father's death. Okay. Gathering the lost. I say we act now and strike while the iron is hot! No, 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 no. The few men we have would be cut down like lambs to the slaughter. We need time to gather our forces. Nonsense. I shall take six of my finest men into enemy territory by the cover of darkness and... No, 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 just listen. Our men are close to starvation. This is what we must do. The debate rages on well into the night, but eventually Lord Woolsack takes you to one side. Sir Longarm tells me he knew your father well, which is why I'm giving you your chance to prove yourself. It is time you got your first taste of command. Okay, so here we have uh, the map, uh, some neutral land, we've got the Rats Kingdom, guessing we're going to play through up until there that we start attacking the rat. Uh, we have the Snake's Domain, which is like most of, well, all of Wales and a little bit. Um, the Land of the Pig is just there. And then heading up towards Scotland, the Wolf Slayer. Okay, so 
move on. We Check. need you to oversee the setting up of a good-sized base camp. Start by finding a suitable clearing, then use some of the wood plentiful in this area to begin your construction. Okay, so simple, whoop, simple objectives. Uh, basically, stockpile twenty meat and forty wood. Okay, what well we got at the bottom? Uh, objectives, we don't do objectives. Hints, not going to look at that. And a tutorial. No, just keep Place going. a keep to site your castle, my liege. Okay, so now we've got to place our keep, which is like a basic, with our uh, villagers, civilian type people appear. And where my character kind of lives, uh, that little white thing next. Ooh, excuse me. White thing next to uh, the, the keep is the stockpile, and just in front they have a campfire, and that's where the the homeless villagers kind of well, the unemployed villagers live. So, okay, we'll place it here, right in the middle. Yeah. Cite your granary, sire. Should be a good one. Uh, granary. That's where we store all our food. So. We have that next to the stockpile for this, uh, for this man, for this mission. Should be alright. Okay, this, this is our little character, that's me. Uh, I think I can select him, although I can't command him, he just wanders around. You can see on the campfire this little green ring. Um, if your popularity is high, which is 81, just here, uh, people will come and like living your your kingdom. Um, I think I got what we got set eight out of eight now. Eight out of eight uh, population. If I wanted more, I could just go down, build a hovel, and it adds an extra couple of uh, living space. Um, if your popularity goes down too much, people that I think that turns red, and people start leaving. Uh, which is not good because you need you need people to do jobs. Um, so like like a wood car. So we'll place that by the trees. As you can see these are red a couple of red squares here it means I can place it. And the white ones are um, areas that I can place the the structure. Um, and if it appears on the map it means I definitely can put it there. So we will put one there. And we'll have one down here, next to this little group of trees. Um, so I'll have, what have I got? I've got 19 wood already um, for my stockpile. Well, it costs three to put the, the wood cutter and um, cut down. So we'll have another one there. Three should do for now. And the next mission was um, to get food. So we'll use the hunter's post. And we put it kind of near. Uh, a this. message from your scribe. Animal tracks have been reported in the area, sire. Yeah. So we'll put it next to these deer. And um, you want things that close to where you're going to store them as well. Because once, say, this guy goes out now and hunts down a deer, he's going to go all the way to his hut. This, um, you know, turn it into food, and then, then he has to travel to the granary to place it. So, like this wood guy, he's going out, he's chopping his trees down nice and close, but he's going to travel all the way down to the stockpile. Whereas this guy, not very far, um, so it should be. We should do this mission pretty quickly because we've got most things are in a close area to where they need to go. So we'll put another hunter's post there next to, you know, they're travelling around. We have it like, I would say like halfway between things really would be a good, good system maybe. Uh, so we'll go into a little more detail on these uh, reports and stuff here. 
Your popularity. The people love you, my lord. I know. I'm amazing. I'm a good lord. Um, I've got plus one there. Yeah? I mean, I'm popular with tax. Because I, I don't think I've got any tax. Or got no tax. change in the treasury, lord. No tax. So we go. Our food stocks are dwindling, my liege. Right, they're, going up. they're going up slowly, that's fine. But if I was to take that down, a minus four. Oh. The ah, people the love you, my lord. Tax I got plus one. Food I got minus four. So got overall minus three. So every month, my popularity will drop by three. So you gotta kind of balance it out. Zero is good. Because um, it just uh, just stagnates and if you've got a little, little bit of extra pop it out you slowly puts it up. Um, and, and then you keep that server keeps replenishing in. So you get more and more workers and, and civilians. Our granary stocks are growing, sire. Turn that back to full rations. Normal rations. Um, and then my pop out, you should go back up again. The Just people love you, my lord. Uh, and that's pretty much it for now. Got gold there as well. Um, some units later on. Uh, cost gold. Organs. Cost gold as well later on. And if these fell up, you can just place another one down, like that. A message from your scribe. Scouts are reporting that packs of wolves are closing in on the castle. We must get the supplies stored. Yeah, I would imagine pretty close to getting them done now. No change in the yeah. treasury, Lord. 66 wood, what do you got 40 or 20, 40 of them? Our granary stocks are mm. growing, sire. Units of food, 13. So, I think we'll get 20 of that. Uh, let's see, there we go. Oh, we got 12. 12 meat, we need 20. So, shouldn't be wrong, this guy's probably no taking taxes? some. Oh, that makes a nice change. Our food stocks yeah. are dwindling, my liege. Let's see. What time am I going to go back up? Okay, I need that. This guy. He's just killed then, so he's going to take a while to get back. Um, we always speed it up by um, putting another hand or something down. Although we'll probably hit it before. Um, before we need to. Before we catch it, we'll probably hit the, the objective. We've got two unemployed there. Build castle things and so you get like walls going around. That can be like a massive base room. This area, like later on, if they, they decide to use it as a, a base, it's uh, quite small actually. You've got a many buildings in there. Underline wood. Our food stocks are the dwindling, food. my liege. I should oh, there we go. We've got two two lots of food going in there. So I should take us over the objective. There we go. Whilst the men frantically ferry precious supplies into the granary, Sir Longarm and Lord Woolsack ride into the camp. Job well done. Not too bad for your first attempt. No, no, no! The foolish pitched camp in the middle of the wolves' migration track. 
Good. It will give the men some well-needed practice before we make our strike. Oof. Now I have no choice but to send out a scout to find a more permanent position. Yeah, I could have told you that. Okay. Uh, so that was... Ah, it's mission two, that's fine. Um. Day by day, the camp... Oh. No, no, no. Oh. To ensure the safety of your men, you are required to renovate the abandoned stockade bef... Right, okay. Before we go any further... Uh, okay, so that was mission one, gathering the lost. Um, so, next episode, boom. Finishing the fort. Um, so that should... Uh, I should be building up a little base and stuff like that now. Um, so, thanks for watching, guys, and I hope to see you for the next episode. Uh, so, good night.